While most cops stick to their duty and handle their jobs well, some abuse their power. But what happens when cops harass military personnel? Today, we will be showing you how it went down between idiot cops and good soldiers. Starting with is a body cam footage that captured an interaction between an elderly veteran and a D-Land police officer who initially thought he was a homeless man and arrested him roughly. Let's sit over here for a minute. Oh, I, I didn't know, I didn't know we were. You don't, I mean, you don't we see were, the power lines? I mean, I didn't even look up. Okay, well, maybe you, know you should pay see. attention. Okay. Have a seat over there. Get away from me. Sit over there. You're pushing me away from you? Yeah, I don't need you stepping up to me like that. Sit down. Stepping up to you? Sit down or I'm gonna sit you down. I wasn't stepping up to you, sir. Sit okay. down. Sit down. Do you understand that? When yeah. I tell you to do something, you do it. Yeah, is that right? Okay. You're on a power trip? Is that what it is? No. Okay. I need you to listen. That's what's up. Who are you? I mean, I, okay. I, I mean, I saw that he was distraught, and I was just trying to help. Okay, I appreciate your help. That's true. Do you live around here? Yeah, just next street. Okay. Well, I appreciate it, sir. Yeah. You're good to go. I mean, I was just trying to help. Him. Okay. Was Thank you. Have, have a nice day. Just All right, man. Okay. God bless. Okay. And I hope you Yes, sir. Okay. What's your name, man? My name's Alan. Alan, what? Kid. Kid. Yes, sir. Are you homeless? No, sir, I am not homeless, okay. okay? So what's going on with you today? Nothing. I'm just standing on the street corner talking to this guy I just met, and all of a sudden you're pushing me down and being real physical with yeah. me. Yeah, you know and why? I don't understand. No, I okay. don't know why. Okay? Lower your voice. Lower your voice. Really? Okay? Do I have to do this? Yes, I'm telling me? you the voice. Okay. Listen to me. Because I'm going to tell you one more time. John? I'm going to tell you one more time and you're going to go to jail. Is that right? Lower your voice or you're going to jail. Listen to this guy, okay? Do you believe in this? Lower your yes. voice or you're going to jail. I'm not. Oh, I'm you're not going to go to jail. Base. So listen, we are going to start over again so you can learn. Go ahead and keep moving forward. I'm going to lay you out on I'm the ground. I'm just trying to get more comfortable, okay? You are going to calm down, and we're going to have a normal conversation, you and that you're going here? to understand why I'm here. Okay, if tell you me. shut up and listen for a minute, you tell will me. understand. I'm ready. We were called here because you were here, supposedly yelling at the cars and causing a scene. Negative. Okay. Let that, me, that, are you going to stop talking so I can explain negative, to you? Negative. Okay. You're about to go to jail. I wasn't yelling at you. You're any cars, about okay? to go to jail. That is the last time that I tell you. Next time, you're going to have handcuffs on you and you're going to jail. We were called here based on what, what's going on. Whether it's true or not, it is not, I have no clue. That's why I'm here, to figure out what's going on with you. When you walk up to an officer and you get that close to an officer, it is not good. Why? Because now you're in my personal space. So I am telling you to back up, and when okay you don't back for, up, it's when okay you don't back for, up, for you, yes, when I give you an order, space, right? Because okay? when I give you an order, because you're on a power trip, because, because when I give you an order, badge. is that right? Because when I give you an order and you don't follow it, that's what happens. I told you to back up, and you didn't. I told you back up again, or I'm going to sit you down, and you didn't. So I sat you down. That's how it works. Is Do that you understand how it works? that? Yes. So what's going on with you that you're yelling at cars or whatever? I'm Where are you ye yelling at cars? No, sir. Okay. Absolutely Where do you live? Not. Okay? Where do you live? I live in Deland, North Deland. Okay. No, where in I'm North on my way, I'm on my way home, okay? Okay. Were you having some kind of issue? Did you need some assistance? Absolutely not. This guy was just trying to help me and be a good Christian. Help okay? you on what way? In what way? What uh, do you need help with? A spiritual way, okay? Okay. Do you live with somebody? No, I, okay. I... Do you I have don't. ID on you? Huh? Do you have ID on you, sir? Yes, sir, I okay. sure do. I don't understand why, you, why you're why you doing this, why you're pushing Because I don't out. like people testing me. I don't like people I don't not like my Nazis orders. Nazis, either. Okay. Are, are you done? Can I show you my ID? Give me the arm. Give me your arm. Can I show you my ID? Hold on, let's get his backpack off. Oh. The officer asks the man for his ID and place of residence. The man provides his ID, but refuses to disclose his address. The situation escalates further, with the officer accusing the man of not following orders and the man calling the officer a Nazi. I got the letter. 
Send up, man. Good. Can I have my ID back? Can I can I have my ID back? Be quiet, please. Spread your feet. Which uh, one of your? Hold on there for a second. Do it. I'm gonna put on my gloves. Can you please pick up my ID before we, we go? We will. I got that. I've done <coughs> nothing. Stop no. talking! What? Ah, uh, 41 Central, Dome Mill 1015. Stay in the car. I'm not going anywhere, but I don't understand what's going on, okay? Well, you're, you're going, going to jail. Right? Hey, look up. Look away from him. You're going to let him go. Yeah, I got it. You're good. I got it. understand what I've done wrong, okay? Have a seat. After the arrest, an investigation showed the cop violated policy during the arrest and was fired. When it comes to cops versus soldiers, the cop in the next video takes it to a whole new level and regrets it. Yeah, sorry. Hello. Hey. I don't know who that is. You know who that is? No. Who's your uh, your girlfriend or your baby mama? Lady right here. First of all, that's my wife, Marvel. Okay. Mar okay. And who? Connor. Who are y'all looking for? One or two. Can you go with the mother's Wait, name? What's the problem? So we're here on a welfare check. We have to so make hang sure on. she's okay. Because we received a call from North Bay for the incident that occurred earlier. What incident? What's your last name? Kelly. Look, look right there. Who's being investigated? If y'all investigate. Right there. Nine years, U.S. Army. Now, what's the problem? Okay. What's your first name? I don't have to identify myself to you, do I? Am I under investigation? You want to no. tell me what's going on? One of two. Can you confirm the address? Can you come out here? No, she can't come out there. Y'all need to tell me what's going on. This is my house. Don't, don't. Copy. They're Please advising that this check. is not the right address. A welfare check for what? No, I, Hi, ma'am. What's got ma'am? Y'all violating my rights right now. Actually, no, we're, we're not. not, dude. Yes, you are, because no, you're not, not telling me okay. what that is. Okay. I said it to you. Listen to me, dude. We're not violating your rights. You are. How? Because Wait, you, which, you, which right? You, which, you, you, which civil right are we violating? Why are you raising your We're rights? not violating Why anything, okay? Why is he raising So we are we are here on a welfare check. The couple is a Suisun City family who, in this case, were victims of mistaken identity and an incorrect address. Later, they were surrounded by the police in an intense exchange that resulted in the officer being fired. I don't know what that Oops. means. Stop talking, let me talk. I don't have Over to stop child talking. That okay. right. that Why is he I don't like to, I don't like him. A person He's raising that his voice at me right now. Or nail polish, okay? Okay, so we're we here, here your check on right there. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna talk here. to you. First of all, came to my house and say, is that my girlfriend okay. or my baby mama? That's my wife. Okay. So that's disrespectful starting okay. off. All right, sir. So That was disrespectful starting off. And, okay, and then he's raising his voice at me. Okay, I okay. understand. So now I can raise my so voice, right? So, no, you can eat it. 
What's his problem? Okay. Okay. No, nah, I need your badge numbers. I'm sorry. That's fine. I'll I'm give sorry. you my badge number. But so the reason we're here is now to make you're sure somebody is okay. Sir, so you tell me to eat, right? That, I, Marler, I messed up. I apologize. Now that you on film, you messed up. No, so, you so you, you haven't violated any of my no, rights. No, the sir. first thing you said to me coming here was, so, "Is sir. that my baby mama or my girlfriend?" Sir, then he so started raising his voice at me. From North Bay. Pause. I need your name and your badge number. Officer Conma, 107. Thank you. I need you your name and your badge Officer number. Officer Marler, 102. And, and she's at my window. I told you not to go to my window. Close the blinds. Do you have a 14-year-old son? Close the blinds. Hold on, sir, sir. Close the blinds. Sir, do you have a 14-year-old son? Close the blinds. Close the blinds. I'm not going in the house. Are your Close children the blinds. okay, ma'am? Are your children okay? okay? Okay. Do they look okay, guy? He's asking if my children are okay. Who the okay. is that? Okay. What are y'all talking we're, about? We're going to leave now. Give me Why? Because I got to eat. That's why you leaving now? We're going to leave now. Who a 14 -year -old. My family was here all day. We had a good day. You're here telling me to eat a d it is. I don't know who the 14 year old is. Okay. I don't know. Either. Okay. I told you I had nine years in the military. Okay, we You told me to eat it. So good. Okay, thank you for telling me to eat it. Please. After okay. I served you for nine years, you. Parlor. I, 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 my property. As well. Parlor. I don't give a You are probably a piece of <laughs> If you served and you telling okay. people to eat you probably was a piece All right. You can get out of here. That's okay. what you can do, Marler. You Okay, let me explain, because we may have you been... Said the... Can I, can I Wait, explain to you? you guys... The family, still reeling from shock and fear, faced verbal harassment from one of the officers who used aggressive language towards Sira in front of his family. By the time the officers recognized their error and attempted to apologize to the army sergeant, the damage had already been done. What the is that? Get in the house. What what are y'all talking about? Nobody knows what y'all are talking about. Well, you're not letting me explain. You never explained. You started asking questions. He said, is that my girlfriend about maybe mama? Okay, I apologize for that. Okay, I'm here to clarify. So it may have been a miscommunication between North Bay and our dispatch. So we got a call that we need to... Okay, a three-year-old was brought into the hospital because she ingested nail polish remover. Okay. We don't know anything about okay. any of that. And that is absolutely fine. So this just I got know, a little out of hand. But you don't come to somebody's house and say, if that's your baby, I'm your girlfriend. You right, and I, am, I completely understand you're that. You're supposed to be professional. It was I'm trying my best to be professional. And, if, and, and, and it, you, you're doing fine. But okay. that guy, I don't know what the side of the bed he woke up on. Had Put yourself in my shoes. Two cops knock on your door. Boom, boom, boom. I'm in there having a good time with my wife okay. of five years. They are who, I, who I have now okay. scared. Okay. You, you probably scared them. They don't know officer friendly yet. You're knocking on my window. All right. you the aggressive officer who screamed vulgar words has now been fired, and the police department has apologized to the army sergeant. The military veteran, now an actor playing cop roles in movies, is asking for more training for officers. If you thought that was harsh police treatment, wait until you see the next video, where even a veteran's dog is not spared from police brutality. I just saw you take money from that car. Yeah, you saw me take money, but you didn't see me ask. All right, let me get your ID, okay? You can't ask for my ID. For yes, I can. Giving me money. Okay, get your dog, okay? Yes, I can. It's called panhandling. But it's not panhandling if I didn't ask for it, is it? ID. You can give me your ID or you can go to jail for RDO. Which one you want to do? What's the ID for that? Because I'm about to write you a citation. For what? For panhandling. That's not panhandling. Yes, it is. No, it's not. If you come up to me and give me money. You walked out to the car. Because they stopped. Did you see them okay. stop? Give me your you ID. You saw the whole situation. Give me your ID or you're going to jail for RDO, which is resist, delay, obstruct. Okay. You're going to write a disabled veteran that's living in the woods a ticket. Yes, because I asked you not to do it, and you I did. I didn't do it. You and see I sit me. There I and come watch here. I'm packing my stuff up. I sit there and watch you. You watch me walk up the sidewalk. Your bag of thirty city. I'm out with that, that subject. Like that you literally way. watch me walk up the sidewalk. Okay, you give me your ID. Give me your ID. You're going to write me a ticket. Yes. Yes. I didn't commit a crime. You, vi you violate a city no, ordinance. I didn't. No, I didn't. There's no city ordinance that says somebody can't give me money. I and you obstructed have. traffic. No, I didn't. They okay. did. They okay. did. They obstructed traffic. Give me your ID. the one in the car. Give me your ID, sir. I'm not giving you my ID because okay, I didn't break the I'm not doing it. No channel, but I probably need a sergeant out here. He's refusing to give me his ID. What? Uh, 
Forty City. I'm clear. I'll be in route tour. Right. Now, now you see we got a sergeant and multiple units on their way out here, and I can almost guarantee you it's it's, it's not going to go the way you want it to go. I want to talk to a supervisor. He's on his way out here. Long. He's on his way out here. Doing all right, sir. Oh, uh, just out with him. I told him he couldn't be on the median. Yeah, and that's and why I was packing my stuff up. Walk out to a car to get money. Yeah, I saw him at the Circle K the other day uh, with the car. Yeah. yeah. Joshua Rohrer is a military vet who was harassed on the 13th of October 2021 for collecting money from a vehicle by Gastonian Police Department officers, Officer Maurice and Officer Sierra Brooks. He is asked to provide his ID, which he refuses on the ground that it wasn't necessary for him to show them his ID. So now he's refusing to give me his ID because I'm going to write him. She's, to the she's trying to write me a ticket because I was walking up this, packing no. up. She told me to pack up. I told and you, I was literally I rolling up my listen, roll listen, and somebody stopped listen, and gave me money. Listen, you listen. saw it yesterday. He saw it too. People you, give me money without me okay. asking. I don't have because, to because, because you're, first of all, I mean... It, it, it can be inferred, okay, because that's the way the law works. Right. Things can be inferred. So if it appears that you're violating the ordinance, but, that's how that works. Right, but if so, you if you're so so so, let me but, tell you, because because you're not a lawyer, right. you can get one. But I can tell you how the law works. You're in the median, right? You're waving at people in the median and after you were, after you I've told you. Down like this. Yes. I sit there and observe you, and that lady is a witness down there. Yeah, and I, I walked up look, here listen, I packed listen, up like you told I, me. I just to. want you to know, you can go to jail for this ordinance. If you, if you can listen, if you, conti listen, if you continue, if you continue to argue with officers, you're going to go to jail, I'm and, you're, and, and, and we're going, and we're going, and, and we are, and we are, and we are going to call animal control for your dog. You got it? That's that. Okay. But so, so no. If I do, you cannot, you cannot be, you cannot, you cannot be here. That's fine. I told her I was leaving. Okay, and I interpreted you asking for money because yeah, that is. And you walked to the car, dude. You saw it. I was standing here talking okay, to you right now. You don't give me your ID. You go to jail and call an animal control dog. For what? You're working yeah, yeah, a ticket for a crime. Can we get your ID? Can we get your ID? Dude, I didn't commit this crime. But you're also in the median after I've told you not to be here before. Have, have I not said that? And that's why I was vacating because she asked me to leave. And I was literally walking up here. I didn't ask anybody money. for money. Okay. That's right. I'm taking this to trial. You can. That's fine. You can. It's going to go to trial anyway. You don't even have to ask. Oh, it's me. going to trial. Oh, I know. You're wasting taxpayer dollars. Okay. Well, I pay my taxes too. There you go. No, we, your state ID, not your VA this ID. This isn't valid. It's not valid. I, I need your state ID, not your VA ID. I'm going to ask you one more time. It's when not even valid. Give me it's your state ID. Uh, turn around. You're being arrested. Whoa, what turn for, around. dude? Turn around. Are you kidding turn me? Around. Turn around. Do you see this? Turn around. Somebody help me. Turn around. Hey, what are you doing? Stop. 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 What are you doing? Mama. Hey. What are you doing? Hey. Call your dog off. Do Call your do dog off. Call your dog off. Call your dog off. Call your dog off. Sir, call your dog off. Call your dog off. He just bit me. He bit me. Call your dog off. To Charlie. Call your dog off. Call your dog off. Call your dog off. Call your dog off. We need, we need. To Charlie Ten City, we need more units. We need more units. Stop. Why are you doing this? Somebody help me. Record. Turn around. Record this. Turn around, sir. Turn, sir, turn around. No! Turn away. Why are you doing this? To Charlie Ten City, take the deployed on the dog. Why are you no, doing no, this? Charlie Ten was bit by the dog. It bit my foot, and I knew it was going to bite you, sir. So. Charlie Ten was bit by the dog. Ten four, it didn't break my boot, but it bit my boot. Help me! What are you doing? Negative. Relax and give me your hand. Why are you doing this? I haven't done anything. Are you cooperating? Sir, his dog bit me. His dog bit me. His dog bit me. His dog has never I get you, but when, but when we are out here trying to get something from him and it won't happen. I have to do what I have to do. The dog bit me, okay? No, it didn't, because you shot him with a taser. Please help me. Why are y'all doing this to me? What did they ask you for? They, they asked, asked me for my ID, ID, and then he grabbed me and tackled Sir, me. because you wouldn't give it to me. Floor. I was in the process of handing it to you. Guys, y'all, please say with his guys, because his guy has been out here for months. His guy was never 
Okay, okay, we're going where we have they to go. They tased my dog. They tased it. Please record this. It's really sad how the dog We got one. Please record this. Why are y'all doing this to me? Disgusting here all the time. Dude, I get it, but it doesn't change the fact that the dog reason. bit me. Okay? Can y'all just back up, please? Did you see the dog bite his foot? Dude, he tased my okay. dog. Of course. Dog like, seriously, why are y'all doing this to me? Okay, her? but we have to do our job. We have okay, to do our job. Here's the thing. Y'all didn't see the whole story, so just back Dude, up. you didn't either. Why are you harassing me? Mean. Joshua is then arrested and his dog Sunshine is tased by the officers. He even cries out for help, claiming he is being kidnapped by the officers. Somebody please help me, they're trying to kidnap me. <laughs> did, did he see the dog bite? I don't know what they did with Sunshine. Where's my dog? Sunshine Ray. I need my dog, she's my medical device. Where's my dog? 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 Man? What are y'all doing with my dog? Where's my dog? Wait a second. I get, but, but when, we're, when we're trying to detain the owner, of course the dog's going, and I asked him to call his dog off. The dog got on, the dog got on the hood of the car, and the dog began barking. The dog, the dog initially barked and bite, bit my boot, but it didn't break my boot. I don't, I didn't want, I did not want this dog to bite my partner. You understand? Okay, we asked for his ID. He refused us to give us his ID. <laughs> Ma'am, I need your I'm not sure. She's mad because he's here all the time, and they don't like they don't like the fact that we had to do what we had to do. Please help me. I'll tell you. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah, it didn't break. But everybody's out. Gonna go up. Everybody's out here. His dog initially bit me. No, it didn't break my boot. It got on the thing and I, and the dog, and and I shot the dog. her while she was running I didn't, away. I didn't shoot her. I tased her. Yes, he did. Oh, oh, he oh, tased oh, oh, oh. her for no my camera's reason. Still my dog never So he was out here. We've been, we told him. I'm just going to give you a background on the whole story. We told. I came out here last week. All right. He was in the median. I told him to remove from the median because he is begging for money. He says, I'm just waving. I'm not doing anything. I was like, okay, well, you, at least you have to get off the median, okay? You can't be in the median. He's like, basically, he's like, well, I, I can be on the sidewalk. He went over to the sidewalk. I let that be, okay? Today, Brooks was out here with him. She watched him. She saw him take money from people, getting money from people. You can articulate that as solicited money because he's standing in the median after I told him last week not to do the same thing. Okay. Uh, I guess he refused to give Brooks his ID. He refused to give Brooks his ID. So he gave us his VA ID and I said, no, not your VA ID. I need your, your license. Okay. I understand the VA ID doesn't have certain information on it. I'm also, I'm also, I'm also a veteran myself. I, I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, um, and that's the ID he tried to give us and I told him, I was like, Hey, can I get your state ID? And he kept, you don't need anything else? No. good? Uh, he's in the back here when we open it up. Did y'all ever get a, is that his normal? Okay, perfect. This is the one he did not want to give you? He's just being very argumentative, like very tense. Say again? What's the call? The call was him panhandling. Oh. And so I spoke to him, and then I went off to speak to the witness. He's like, You've all, did, have you told him today, get off the media? I told I told him a few days ago. Okay. And it's on camera. I can find it. It was That's on the other shift, I but believe. You've, been, you've told him. I've told him before get so to get off the media. If you think that was the height of brutality, the next video might just prove you wrong. This is body cam footage showing Denver police officer Lane with badge number 18067 pushing a 61-year-old U.S. Coast Guard veteran to the ground. Can I get your, what's your name and badge number? What's your You're name? You're interfering with me protecting these officers. They're talking to you, aren't they? No, they're not. Okay. No. Then what is it that I was talking to him. I, what's your name and badge number? Lane 18067. You got a card? What is it I can help you with? I didn't ask for your help. I asked okay. you for a card. Okay. I gave you my name and badge number. I'm asking you for a card. No. You're too hostile right now. You're causing a disturbance. I'm not here. No, you guys are causing a disturbance. I was just standing here. Step back. You're Thank too you. close. You're right.
Two. Step back. You're too close to my face. Throw me. Step back. Throw me. Step back. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hey. What the hell are you doing? I want to assault charges on him now. Now. Clearly, the officer doesn't like the freedom of speech directed at him, and his actions caused the veteran an injury to his knee. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel for more content.